nice haircut, man. Look at that shit. Thanks. God damn! That's a good looking head of hair right there. Woo! <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. My Argentinian bar barbers, Rico Suave, as Rico I call him. Rico Suave. <laughs> <laughs> nice fine cookies. Look, we got fans. We love nice fine. <laughs> this is so awesome. Look at this. Yeah. And those are the two best days. Dollar day and seven dollar day. <laughs> yep. Dude, this is so sick. I can't believe. Look at this. That's our logo. Like spot on. And not only are they pretty, but her cookies are delicious. And awesome staff from Race. Wait, what's the business name? Sugar Cookies by Jen. Quick advertisement. She's okay. awesome. She does amazing work. That is amazing. Look at this. It's on Facebook. <laughs> That's awesome. We're gonna we're gonna make a post, yeah? Awesome, awesome. Give you guys a shout out. Thanks, Tracy. We appreciate no, no, no. it. Miss Mom, I guess still make sure I can use your logo because I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> That's amazing. You guys That's are awesome. so awesome. I'm cooking, man. Not bad. <laughs> it's a good cookie. Um, um, see nice Wednesday going on today. Give the people the well, they want to see the action out here. <laughs> You're the action, man. <laughs> Hi, Jasmine. Hi. <laughs> Don't be camera shy. <laughs> What's up? Say hello to the camera. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> What's up guys, Damien here from Nice Client, and today it's Xbox Raffle Time. Recording good? Everyone, yeah, we're everyone good. watching? Alright, for sure. Good. But before that, quick announcement. This Saturday guys, Memorial Day Saturday, we're going to have a $30 pillow bag sale. We're calling the spring cleaning sale. You can see I'm pretty hot and sweaty right now because we're putting the work in Nice Client, so. <laughs> Like I said, $30 fill bag sale this Saturday, but the reason why you guys are all here, let's see who wins this raffle, right? <laughs> Decent amount of tickets. Tickets zero seven zero five six five five. Jose Aldire Aldair. I don't want to blast this phone number for whole Facebook to see. Come pick up your Xbox, Jose. I'm putting it in the office. Seven zero five six five five. Like claim these, I'll do more. And come see us this Saturday for a spring clean out sale, $30 fill bag sale, a nice find. Thanks for playing, guys. All right, so that was just our live recording of the raffle. So we were on Facebook Live, and, you know, we had the second camera out for YouTube. So that's how we did the raffle, guys. What's up, guys? Tomorrow is fill a bag and nice find. So that means we're spring cleaning, and we're going to show you how to restock a bin extra quick. <laughs> right, KK? Well, it's our first time trying, though. <laughs> <laughs> it shouldn't be too bad. Damn, look at that product flowing. Be gentle, man. What's up guys, June 1st today, after a long weekend, Memorial Day weekend. New stuff is coming today, right? Or right, we're doing new stuff in the store today. We're gonna clean out the bins because we had the fill bag, and then we're gonna start rearranging the store just to change stuff up. Um, so yeah, today we're just gonna be cleaning, and then the next two days, we're gonna start arranging stuff. We got out here like five, we have six, around six bins out right now. But today we're gonna get all this out, box it up, put it in for as donations, and then we'll do a deep clean of the bins. 
We like to do deep cleans after every fill a bag just to get them nice and clean. Three grand opening time, baby. We're getting ready for a re grand opening this weekend. We're gonna open up Fridays. We never were open Fridays. But uh, yeah, we're reconstructing the store a little bit and getting things done, spring cleaning. And this is what the bins are looking like now. So new layout, we're getting carts. Cleaned out the bins, nice and clean. Registers. Nice job, look at this. Sparks and clean, huh? Theresa, wave. <laughs> How do you feel about this reconstructing? It's a lot of work. It's a lot of work, man. I'm sweating right now. But it looks good. That's all the overstock from uh, that Kami was cleaning out yesterday. We're gonna have Natalie come pick it up and then donate it. Oh, Are you still single after Memorial Day? <laughs> Are you? Let's not talk about it. Tell me. Answer my question. Yes. I'm going to a wedding this weekend, so. You're bringing a date. No, I'm not. If any of you ladies watching right now want to go to a wedding with this man, it's too late. He's got three this summer. Three weddings? Three weddings, ladies. Look at that face. Poor mm. <laughs> 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 Sam wants to showcase the books we find here. Yeah, some <laughs> very interesting titles. That's really interesting, to say the least. All right, Foss Dr. Wildlife, Crusade of Northern Woods Veterinarian. Ooh, what an interesting very read. Very interesting Thank read. Thank God these are all a dollar at Nice Find. Yeah, let's see. We do get a lot of good books, too. Hispanic Marketing, Connecting with the New Latino Consumer. This has been consumer. here for a uh, good three months. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, donate that one. It's, yeah. It's, yeah. <laughs> Also got compressed air data. Ooh. Very fancy looking book. It's got like the pa the golden pages and everything. Very fancy. <laughs> the art of exercising a pizza. Ooh, and I gotta give this to my dad right here. That outdoor journal by Jimmy Carter. Goddamn, Jimmy Carter, eh? History of the United States. Hmm. We get a lot of textbooks. Yeah, that you're, definitely looks like a textbook. If you're a reseller looking for textbooks to resell online, this is the spot to do it. I mean, we still got like new books that we haven't even put out yet so yeah definitely somewhere. this is a devil worshiping graphics. book for sure <laughs> getting fit baby thank god it's monday <laughs> how to create a workplace you and your customers love there you go that's for you david <laughs> you gotta you read mean? this you guys should read this book people already love life fine huh? we get a lot of these the leadership wisdom of jesus yeah it's a lot of jehovah witness books too oh yeah <laughs> Town to 10 Social Services. There Thank you, you so much. Nice finds. They donate to us because we take care of the community. So they take care of us, which means they take care of the community. Right? Look at, <laughs> look at you. I just put you on the spot and look, you're just killing it, huh? <laughs> awesome, awesome. Yeah, so if you guys are ever wondering what's going, what goes on with our overstock, Natalie, Nat Natalie takes care of it all. Yes. Talented. 10 social, social services, services in Aurora, Illinois. Yeah. In, they do a lot of good for the gaps, community. Right? This is Brother Winton. Hello, Brother Hello, Winton. And Spartan Dads. Guys, this Ford Ranger. It, it got stuck. <laughs> How long was it stuck here in the back? In the snow? For three days. <laughs> it seemed it was like three days, but yeah. you know what? Oh, man. I the men to cry. never stopped. Damien <laughs> and his crew. We had to call out Elgin all the way out here, and we finally got. <laughs> This two-wheel drive truck. Two, yeah, don't ever buy a two-wheel drive don't pickup in the Midwest, right, Natalie? You learned this already? It. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> Four-wheel drive Silverado rides right past me, right? <laughs> he really did. Restock is on the way. June 3rd, no, June 4th, we're opening up, right? <laughs> but today's Wednesday, so we have two more days before the big grand reopening. Um, and like I said, things are going pretty well. We got the bins. Fill it up, we're restocking. Ooh. Store's looking clean. We still have to clean the carts. We have to uh, mop the floors, vacuum the floors. 
We gotta crack a couple of um, clothing pallets so we can arrange our little clothing racks right there. We're gonna have a bunch of clothing along that wall. Um, I have to pick up some flyers and I have to hang up some posters, the new posters. Um, I think that's pretty much it. I think we got pretty much figured out. Just gotta make sure that there's a big nice line for, yeah, for the re-grand opening on Friday. And then we're gonna be running a brand new schedule, which is gonna be a $7 Friday, $7 Saturday, $5 Sunday, $3 Monday, $2 Tuesday, $1 Wednesday, uh, which is different because we were closed on Fridays for the restock. But since we've been open for almost six months now, we kind of got our systems down. We know now that for a fact that we can and we will be restocking in one day and then restocking again from Friday to Saturday. So you get a double day, double days of deals, double days of $7 uh, sales, which is awesome because it's gonna help us push a lot more of the stuff so we can bring in a lot more stuff and then sell a lot more stuff and give everyone a better deal. So um, yeah, exciting stuff. Like I said, today's Wednesday, so we got two more days left or one more day left and then Friday's the big grand reopening. This is uh, in the middle of the restock. Let's see what the bins have. Got a nice little FM radio, $7. Contour, 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 Jesus. Humidifier, electric class kettle. Yeah, throw them out. Yeah, toss it. It's not worth someone getting hurt in the bins, yeah, yeah. you know? No, right, if they're empty like this, that's like, okay, like, you don't, you know what I mean? Like, this. A lot of nice stuff this weekend. Okay. Yes, it is. I knew it. Man, an eye for these things. This keyboard. So what I'm showing you guys is literally like the first two hours of the restock. Um, we still have. Oh, well, hold on. We did one, two. So we have put out around 10 pallets so far of all Amazon. We still have like three, four targets. Depends on how the bins look. We're gonna put out three, four coals just for Friday and then we're gonna do another 10 of Amazon. So in total, I wanna be at around 30 pallets for the Friday big grand reopening, and then we're gonna restock with another six to eight. So overall, for the week, we should be running at around 40 pallets, which is give or take almost a truck. A truck is considered 48. We're gonna be around 40 pallets. So um, like I said, it's still a lot of inventory to go out, but we're gonna get there, so. KK's doing in the back. 10 bucks, he's slacking off, per usual. Hey! Where are you at? Right here. Are you slacking off? <laughs> <laughs> All right guys, been throwing a life 101 right here. Look, so we find stuff like this, right? In the same, so you got a cold brew maker, we got like a crock pot, we got a Keurig, like we got a bunch of nice stuff, right? Like this, we got a, I robot vacuum. These are like two, three hundred dollar items, right? But in order to find these, <laughs> you also find stuff like these. How many? Uh, <laughs> oh, there's more. Jesus. This ZB sleep melatonin for kids. A hundred, a hundred, a hundred, a hundred, a <laughs> hundred, one hundred. Ah! So we're probably at six, seven hundred. What would you say, Sam? And this yeah, is uh, right. from this week. Yeah, this is just um, from one box. One box. From yeah, from one Gaylord. But so, like I said, we pull out some nice stuff, like some, you know, there you go, like a Keurig, and then so you got some bad head, whatever it might be, steam cleaners. You got some nice electronics, but then you have to deal with stuff like this. Hey, at least it works. Oh yeah. I took yeah, the, a, I took a couple one the, night. The whole I other. took a, a full dose and I knocked out like the, ten hours. The whole store has been sleeping very well since these have been coming in. <laughs> been store owner life 101 right here. You get some good stuff, you get some really cool electronics and items, and then you have to deal with that and you have to figure out how to get rid of seven hundred kids melatonins and not lose money on it. All right, guys, it's Thursday. We're ah, probably 24, 20 hours away from our grand re-grand opening, whatever you want to call it. Um, and yeah, but bins are 95% done. I just posted a sneak peeks on Facebook. And uh, yeah, I'll just show you guys around what we got going on so far. 
just tons of home stuff. Toys. Uh, just random things. Like scrub daddies. <laughs> Literally anything from a freaking hose to Starbucks cups <laughs> to LED lights. Wow! Ah! Drop it. I've been dealing with all morning, just trying to figure out this the, these registers and how to send cables from here, where are we at? Here to the registers here, and I got these cable management. Covers, whatever you call them. But we just had to move these registers, so all my hard work got thrown away, got ripped apart. So we moved, so they used to be here, we moved them up here. We thought we'd have enough space, but because we're adding carts that we're gonna park here. It screwed up my whole system. This is our biggest improvement, I'd say, for the re-grand opening is carts. Um, we got a bunch. We got we got some small carts, and we got the big carts. There's only 20 carts. I still have 10 in the back. I want to see um, how people are gonna react to carts. We have we only been using like our bags. We have like these people have been using to shop with. They're pretty big, but. Um, as you can see, like we have tons of big items in the bins and um, people can't grab more than one or two, right? So we want to help the resellers, we want to help the people that stand in line for a very long time to get as much uh, stuff as they possibly can, right? To get the biggest bang for their buck. So like that one's fine, that one's not. Like I just loosened up the bowl. Take you as a mechanic. Well, look at the difference. WD-40's not helping? No, like this black thing's moving, uh -huh. right? And on the ones that are decent, the black stuff isn't moving, so there's a bunch of stuff. Oh, stuck I see, in. I see. So you can't get it up. There's like a bunch of hair. We don't even know where the hair is coming from. The ground, man. These are old cards. Progress, progress. Progress update. Ooh. Not too proud of this. Don't judge me, not too proud of this. I will be fixing it next week, but just don't have time to do it right now. Final piece of the puzzle to complete the reconstructing and remodeling. Dude, those look nice. Yeah, they are. There should be five. Let's put one up. Should pull one up right there. Yeah, one up right there, and then maybe right one there. out. Yeah, one outside in a little bit. On the windows, because there's the remember, there's the old ones, and you gotta swap it out with the new pricing and stuff. I just don't know if I want to do this right now. <laughs> ah! You want to cross the right huh? over there? One in the break room, and then one in the office is a reminder how far we've come. <laughs> to an extra day. To an extra day. Yeah, it used to be seven six five three one. Now it's seven seven five three one. Three two one. Three, yeah, two, seven seven three two one. $7 Friday, $7 Saturday. We, our new summer schedule is officially 
and uh, in action. Um, I'm stuffed up because I got allergies up the wazoo, but uh, and there's the stupid white pollen flying around outside. But you guys see, Davey's already been recording. The carts are a great success, um, great addition. I can't believe we didn't do it sooner, um, but we made sure that we spaced out the bins far enough so where people don't run into each other. So like we have two, like look, there's carts right here and you can still easily slide right by. So carts, great success. Seven Hell Friday, so far great success, we'll see. But um, the, the clover will tell me if it was a great success. All right guys, Friday's almost done. And now we got, I think it's like 5.45. So we close at six and we got a restock um, for Saturday. Bonnie's prepping the bins right now. Still got a lot of stuff left. But we had over, I think, a, I mean, we had like 150 people in line this morning. And then throughout the day, it was just busy and then died down around like four. Uh, it's just Friday, I guess. But Sam's back here. Prepping stuff for the restock. All right, it's six o'clock, store is empty, restock time. Let's do it. Restock is done. As you guys can tell, I'm disgustingly sweaty right now. But we cranked it out in about an hour. Um, so yeah, we put out five pallets. Five pallets for the restock. So uh, the bins are looking great. They're packed again. A lot of nice stuff. A lot of small appliances. These are all from Kohl's or Walmart, depends. But um, yeah, plenty of good stuff. We're done for Friday, about to just clean up a little bit, Get some garbage, and yeah, tomorrow's a brand new day, a nice fine $7 Saturday, should be a good turnout.